So here's how to mod lethal company, especially if you want to play brutal company or up to 40 people in the server. Do note that this method can work with any other mods as well. I'm gonna be breaking this video down step by step to ensure that you install it correctly to avoid any issues. But trust me, this is actually really easy, but do follow this guide carefully. Starting with step 1, downloading the correct files. You first need to start off by downloading the following files. Number 1 is Bepanex. This is what allows your mods to work. Simply head to this link right here which will be in the description down below. Click on any of the version that is corresponding to your OS which in my case, it's x64 which should be the same for most people as well. After downloading it, I suggest to place it somewhere where it's easy to find as we'll go back to it later. Now the next thing to download is called the LC API. This is also necessary to allow your mods to work in Lethal Company. Again, link is down in the description below and once you're here, simply click on manual download. Place it in a place where it will be easier to find which in my case, I'll be putting in the same folder as the Bepanex one. Next up, it is time to download both the Brutal Company and Bigger Lobby mods as these are the two most popular mods. For Brutal Company, click on the link below to head over to this page right here and click on brutalcompany.dll to download the file. Place it somewhere easy to find after. And finally, download the Bigger Lobby mods via the link below and then click on Manual Download. Once again, I'll be placing everything into the same folder as the other downloaded files. Now, after all four of them are downloaded, you are now ready to install them. First off, you want to find your Lethal Company folder which is step 2. You can do so by simply heading to your Steam and right-clicking Lethal Company and then choose Properties. Click on Install Files and then browse on the top right here. This should directly bring you to the game's file which we'll be needing for next. Once done, you're ready for step 3 which is to actually install the mods. Now because I've placed all of the downloaded files into one folder, it is easier for me to navigate here. To start off, we'll first want to install Bepanex by opening the zip file and simply dragging all of the content into your Lethal Company game folder. Next up is the LC API zip folder. Same thing, open it up and drag everything into the Lethal Company game folder as well. If it asks you if you want to replace the file, simply click yes. Same goes for the bigger lobby downloader file as well. Simply open it up and drag everything into the game folder. Click yes to replace. And finally, you are left with brutalcompany.dll. To install this, simply navigate into your newly added Bepanex folder in your game files and click on the plugins folder. Drag your brutalcompany.dll into this folder and congratulations, you've now successfully installed the Brutal Company and Bigger Lobby mods. Which leads us to step 4, verifying if the mods are working. You want to first launch your game to check if everything is done correctly. There should be a notification on the bottom left side that reads as V40 mods. The number could change in the future in case of any updates to the mods, but as long as it is there, it means that the mods are now activated. You can further test this out by finding a server and you should be able to see lobbies that are up to 20 or 40 people. You are now also able to join them and have fun with them. And that's about it. Like this video if it helped you out so more people can actually see this. And of course, Happy scrapping in the world of Little Company.